Hello world, and welcome to another episode of Did you know? We love to talk about exciting subjects in science, medicine, robotics, astronomy, futuristic ideas, music, or anything interesting in the news. So let's get into it. Did you know in the news? Ford, a healthcare company, has raised $100 million in growth capital to manufacture and deploy Ford Care Parts, marking a significant step in addressing healthcare challenges. These Care Parts, described as the world's first AI doctor office, combine AI with medical expertise to provide personalized and immersive healthcare experiences. Deploy in locations like malls, gyms, and offices, CarePods offer advanced diagnostic personalized health plans and in-person experiences. Now these memberships for accessing CarePods start at $99 per month. The AI CarePods provide on-demand access to services such as disease detections, biometric body scans, blood testing, and more. Health apps developed by Ford's team of doctors from prestigious institutions enhance the care part experience by turning clinical expertise and medical research into diagnostic tools and robust care plans. The app covers various diseases including diabetes, hypertension, and mental health issues. Ford aims to expand its footprint with CarePods launching nationwide starting in the San Francisco Bay Area, New York, Chicago, and Philadelphia. The $100 million funding comes from blue chip venture funds and notable AI luminaries. Now the funds will be used for manufacturing and deploying CarePods helping Ford address fundamental healthcare challenges such as costs, accessibility, and quality. The company envisions reversing the global health crisis by using technology to scale care globally. Now, healthcare spending in the U.S. has exploded to 20% of GDP. That is 20 cents of every dollar you earn. And what are we getting for it? Life expectancy in the U.S. has decreased over the past 25 years. Globally, the healthcare situation is even more dire. Less than a quarter of the world's population has access to sufficient care. It is time for a real change. What do you think about this? Let me know your opinion. Until next time, stay safe and I'll talk to you soon.